Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House. Today we have the full set of McDonald's Happy Meal toys. These feature the Hasbro games. So as you can see, they look like they're going to be a lot of fun. We have eight of them, which is a complete set, and each one features a different Hasbro game. So let's get started with number one. So number one is Connect Four. And these are really fun because they are like travel size. Let's take a look how this works. Alright, so here is the game piece. Doesn't that cool? So it has a little M with the eyeballs. <laughs> and then we have all these little circles that we can drop our little game pieces in. Kind of snaps in like this, and of course we have the game pieces, which are actually not circles but squares. So here are the instructions. If any piece gets stuck, you have a longer piece to help push it out, and you can also store other little pieces inside. That's really cool. Here are the instructions. Each player selects a game piece color, yellow or blue, and then they take turns dropping in the pieces. And whoever gets four in a row wins. All right, then to play with your friend, you just drop them in. There you go. And you want to get four in a row. Yellow's turn. When you get stuck, you can actually use this piece, this long piece that you can use to help push in little pieces. There you go. <laughs> Alright, and yellow wins! And to take it out, we just have to pop this back out and shake it all out. And then when you're done, you can actually store all the pieces in here. So here's like a little slot for you to store all your pieces. Like that, and then just cover it up. Super cool. Next, number two is the Hungry Hungry Hippos game. I love this game. Alright, so here's the game. Isn't it cute? It comes with two hippos. <laughs> and they're super hungry. And then here are the balls and they're all contained inside this bubble so that you don't lose them. To start the game, you want to flick all the balls so that they're in the middle. So we're going to use this little flicker so that you don't have any balls in these little uh, trenches here. And then you start playing and start dropping. <laughs> Stop grabbing balls until all of them are gone. Oh my gosh, there's one more left. Who's gonna get it? Who's gonna get it? This ball is not cooperative. Alright, then we can count. And it seems like the orange one wins because the orange one has the most balls. Alright, number three. This one is Pie Face. And Pie Face is so much fun. Oh, look at this. Isn't this cute? Oh my gosh, we have a little McDonald's Happy Meal box. And we have a little dice here. So now we're going to take this dice and we're going to roll it and see how many turns of this we need to do. So that's five, one, two. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That is funny. Oh my gosh, I, I like this game. This is too cute. Alright, next, number four is the Guess Who game. These are such classics. I just love this and it's just made so well. Look at this. So here are the two game boards. Each person gets a board and here are the game pieces. And of course you need to um, give hints 
help guess which one is it. These are so neat. Look at this. A skateboard. We have a superhero. One with a little um, hula hoop. Per this one's playing an instrument. <laughs> oh, this is really, really cool. So to set it up, what you need to do is take these cards and just put them in here. Alright, so here is the setup. So everyone gets all these cards and then you take turns asking questions to try to guess the opponent's selected card. So you want to ask enough questions to guess this uh, little happy happy meal guy with a keyboard. And so look at this. Oh my gosh. How cute is this? Alright, number five is the Boppet game. So this is going to be interesting. I wonder how this one's going to be played. So we have another dice. So let's fold this one up. So this one is more of a memory game. So you want to roll it and do whatever it says. And then as you take um, more turns, you keep adding on to it. So if the first one said to twist it, you would take this one and you, let's see. Oh, you would take this one and you twist it. So that's number one. And then he says pull it, and then twist it, and then pull it. <laughs> this one is switch it. And this one is spin it. So as you uh, roll the dice even more, you got to remember the sequence and not mess up. <laughs> and what's really fun is you can actually play from one to four players on this one. Super cool. Alright, three more to go. Number six. This is the Popomatic Trouble Game. Let's take a look at this. And this one actually comes with a game board. Oh, look at this. How cute is this? So we have a game board that we need to put together. So this one is super cute. We have the little game board and here's our little dice and this is how you roll the dice is by popping it. <laughs> Isn't this cute? Oh my gosh. And then here are our game pieces. So the goal of it is to start here in your little colored spot and then make it all the way around the board and back home by rolling the dice. Alright, next one, number seven. such a treat, don't you think? You get all these games. And okay, so I've actually never played Mousetrap before, so this is going to be new for me. Alright, so to play this game, essentially we stacked all the mice up on the hand, and then we're going to take turns and carefully remove the little pieces until the trap door comes down, and then that person would lose because you got caught by the Mousetrap. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is so cute, oh my gosh, this is really, really cute, I like this game. Alright, our last one, so this one is the Battleship game. Ooh. The battleship game is so cute. Look, this one looks just like a little Happy Meal box. And it opens up into a classic battleship board. Oh my gosh, <laughs> look at this. So we have a little area here that holds on to the little um, game pieces. And it even comes with a pencil here. So to play, each side needs to take one of these game pieces and hang them up right here. And then they take turns guessing where their enemies are. So that is super cool. I like this game. This is very self-contained. You can put the pencils and all the papers in and just fold it up like this and take it with you. So cool. Alright everyone, so here are all the toys that came with this series of Happy Meal toys. My favorites are the Hungry Hippo game, the Mouse Trap, and also the Clue game back there. 
So which one is your favorite? Let me know down below in the comment section. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!